these are the hands of your best friend, strong and full of love for you, holding yours on your wedding day as you promise to love each other today, tomorrow, and always. I had the opportunity to first meet Mackenzie on a double date at the bowling alley. Spencer won, by the way. And it did not take long for me to realize what a kind, genuine, and caring person she was and is. They've helped us so much over these past few years and through our own wedding just a couple months ago. We've seen them grow so much in nearly the three years that we've known them. And I knew they were meant to be with each other. The first time I saw them do one of their many choreographed dance moves that you all saw them do as they walked in the door. I must say with Mackenzie, uh, it was a lot different. Um, when the boys were out of the house, Mackenzie, Kathy, and I became a pretty close group. And then Spacer came along, and uh, Mackenzie dumped us. <laughs> About two years ago, I was over at the house, and we were working on this fence, and uh, Spencer asked me for McKinsey's hand, and my mind went blank. What the heck? I was not ready for that at all. Still don't know exactly what I said, but obviously I said yes, because we wouldn't be here if I didn't say yes, so. I know that McKinsey and Spencer are making a solid decision today. Based on their letters, based on what I know with them, speaking with them, spending time with them, this is not a fairy tale fantasy wedding. This is truly a marriage and one that is steeped in reality. They have the most fun together and they always allow each other to truly be themselves and love each other deeply for who they are. And I'm fortunate to have witnessed firsthand how Spencer and Mackenzie's early dates blossomed into a relationship built on love, trust, support, and communication. Spencer, the day I met you, I knew we had a special connection. I remember being so nervous, but I quickly became comfortable around you. Even though I barely knew you, I felt that I had known you for years. <laughs> I haven't even gotten like halfway through. <laughs> oh man. Mackenzie, since the day we met, I knew there was something special about you. It might have been the goofy way you were dancing when you pulled up next to me in your car. <laughs> or your smile as we sat there drinking our smoothies. I also know it did not take long for me to fall in love with you and fall even more in love with you every day from our little conversations while I'm driving to our super awesome choreographed dances. That day I knew instantly that I had gained a best friend. As I left, I remember thinking, how do I already like this guy so much? <laughs> then you drove by me blaring one direction with your windows open, waving at me and dancing away and I knew I needed your contagious, happy-go-lucky personality to stay in my life as long as possible. There is no one better I could have imagined spending my life with. And with that being said... From this day forward, I take you as my husband. I promise no matter how hard life gets, I'll always stay by your side. I promise to do whatever I can to make you smile and laugh every day. I promise to be by your side always, no matter the circumstances. I promise to always love you as much as the dogs. <laughs> I promise to always support your dreams and do everything in my power to help you achieve them. I promise to ask for no more than one back rub a night. <laughs> and I promise to be your best friend and biggest fan for the rest of our lives. I vow to take care of you when you're sick and be your biggest cheerleader. Yuck. <laughs> I have to be a tissue and supporter. I promise to continue to communicate my feelings to you, be understanding of yours, and work as a team to live our best life together. Finally, I promise to be the best wife and hopefully mother someday that I can be. I know life won't be easy and I will always be at my best, but I promise to never give up. Neither of us are perfect and we never will be. All I know is that I want to learn with you, grow with you, support you, be with you, and love you every day for the rest of my life. 
I love you, Spencer Dash. And I'm so proud that I now get to call you my husband. Kenzie, I have my value in the form of this ring, so that my word and my love will always be with you, close to your heart. Spencer, I offer my vow to you in the form of this ring, so that my word and my love will always be with you. Yeah. <laughs> you want your nap. <laughs> <laughs>
that you actually loved each other the least because your love will only continue to grow. So cheers, and I have a glass to the new Mr. and Mrs. Nash. I'll color all your 